I've just shot something that they call the noisy cricket. That's nuts, isn't it? <laughs> That is currently my view at the moment as I sit in the lounge with these feathers. Oh look, we've got to go. So this is the start of the trip to Vegas. So what we're going to do uh, is get is going to get prepared uh, because it looks like we're going now to the gate. So I'm going to pack up, but I'm tight onto this one because we're going to have some fun. Calvin's been picked for a spot check for security. He's so on it, in getting stopped that is. So here we go. This is the tunnel to the actual aircraft. Not that I'm worried or anything. Yes, we are here. One part of Mo Radix is here for SEMA and that is the type of stuff we're gonna be seeing. This thing is, that's just what's parked in the car park but I've just turned up. It's been a bit, it's been a bit mad trying to get landed and get here. So the intro has been a little bit discombobulated but behind me the Sahara Hotel which is where we're staying with Chira and the Petro Hedonism guys uh, it is I've never been to Vegas before but it is everything plus 10 so I'm gonna take you on a little trip around Vegas we've got loads of stuff going on we're gonna cover SEMA we're gonna cover the show uh, and we've got lots of trips out and some fun stuff for Calvin organized so we're gonna get a bit of footage of that but I'm gonna go and get my bag up to the uh, hotel room and uh, Probably have a sit down because I think my body time says it's about two o'clock in the morning. It's five o'clock. I've had no dinner, so I'm going to get started. We've got a few hours to go. It's on a mission. What we're we coming to see, Cal? This is what we're here to see. Look Come all the way to Vegas for this. Look. Look at that. <laughs> oh my god. Do you give it some revs, boy? Mate, go on. Let's have a let's have a listen to it. Look at it. <laughs> So that is Shiro's project that's come to, we'll talk to him in a second, it's come to fruition and it's absolutely stunning. What a place to uh, to show us lot this car as well, the entrance to the hotel, look at this. Shiro, what is this? So this is a Corolla... It's a Mark 1 Escort. It's, <laughs> <laughs> it's, pretty, it's actually pretty. It's a mini Mustang. Escort. 973 um, Toyota Corolla KE25. I don't think any exported to America anyway, so it's going to be like unseen, unknown, very rare in the US. But in Thailand, Pon Retro uh, is my um, inspiration for this. Okay. His one was amazing. We got a body kit from him. But what we did was we took a vision, we put the legendary AE864 AGE, later Corolla engine in there. Yeah. These are upgraded ITVs, paint and carbon fibre. Everywhere. Paint and carbon fiber everywhere. Brought it over from the UK to Vegas for SEMA and like the whole vision's come together and like I'm still pinching myself. Has she met your expectations? Is it as good as what you wanted? Yes, but I don't know if she's good enough for SEMA. I'll find out Tuesday. We'll see. Well, it looks real. stunning mate. It looks absolutely stunning. We're going to Machine Gun Vegas mate. <laughs> Only, no in Vegas. Only in Vegas, no isn't it? <laughs> Come on then, let's see what's going on. What's the first thing you saw on the wall? Oh, a carbon fiber AK. <laughs> Oh my, oh my god. god. <laughs> this is this is Look at this guy. Happy Halloween. I didn't I knew it was gonna be pretty in your face, but welcome to day one and a half. Got here last night, a little bit ropey, but this is the first thing we're gonna do is gonna go and shoot guns. So obviously that's the first thing we're gonna do. Uh, as you can see behind me. It's full selection, full armoury there. It's like that scene from uh, Tremors, one of the guys' garage, but... <laughs> you squeeze it and it goes bang, there you go. That is like, that's all you need to know, isn't it? There's locker space for you guys as well, so pick uh, whatever you want. Yeah, lock space. 
Yeah, that's the least of our problems. We're gonna fit in this room, sorry, like it's an elevator, so come on in. Don't be shy. You're gonna lock on the headgear, the eyes and ears. Make sure the ears cover over the earlobes. That'll muffle out all the crazy noise we're getting ready to walk into here, okay? Is this anybody's first time? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. cool. We'll go That's through this. That's why I'm in America for some. Hey, Alright, come on in. You can hook all your stuff on the wall. I I actually jumped then, and I'm not even the one firing it. Get both your hands around the grip and lock your arms out straight. So go as high as you can. Yes. Hands on first for Owen. Yes. You're keeping that circle in that window, and you're trying to pull the trigger without. That is so much more powerful than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> That's the hardest one out of all of them. Really? Yeah. So they stand there, get out right on that grip. <laughs> oh, here. Yep. Now lunge onto your left leg. <laughs> Just like that, Call of Duty stance. Oh my god. Very good. You're more comfortable with that one. Loads of balls on Oh, mate. That's frightening. That is frightening. That... There you go. Secret agent, man. Oh, this is all like... <laughs> Arrow's going to it. That's perfect. Oh, okay. Then you got a little smiley face. Right? <laughs> Very nice. Right. So she said to me, <laughs> five three so far. She said to me, right, we don't have to make fun out of anyone. Everyone's done pretty well. My grouping was really good. Calvin had that look on his face when he was like, when he tattooed my arm and he was like, I'm not sure about this. The sensation of it, if you haven't done it, it's really quite something. It is, uh, it's, yeah, it's, it's quite a feeling to do. But they were the easy ones. We're going to move on to the big stuff now. Right, so, a little bit shaky now. I've just shot something that they call the noisy cricket. That is an understatement for what it was. You'll see on our social media. But the next thing we got is the Barrett 50 cal sniper rifle. And I've got these lot, so I'm going to get him to record it. Yes. How do you feel, Owen? You're I don't know if I'm ready for this. <laughs> I need a breakfast yet. Okay, keep that finger straight. We're going to use you as leverage. Oh my God. You're hot, man. You're ready to go. Breathe and squeeze. You gave him a party hat right up top. Very good. Okay. I need a little sit down now. <laughs> Everybody take the head gear off and let your brains breathe. Oh, We're done firing. Welcome oh, back to yeah. Shocking, isn't it? Cheer out. I'll film your face this time. <laughs> you guys saw that we did shooting straight after breakfast this morning, but now we're getting stuck into some drag racing. And I've got some footage for you. Because it's Chiro and uh, Chiro and Calvin's first time seeing proper drag racing. So I'm really going to get to see an effect of what pro mod funny car and uh, yeah, and, and uh, like alcohol races are, but this is going to be awesome. That's nice, isn't it? <laughs> that noise. That is it. That's pro mod. And that sounds amazing. I forgot how good that sounds. 483 and a 474. Yeah, they go all right. So we're in the pits at the moment with um, Matt Hagen's team and they're just going for a service on the engine. And when I say a service, I don't mean they're changing the oil. They've had, there's probably six guys working around the motor at the moment. The heads have been off, pistons, rods have been out, they're clearancing bearings, doing the clutches, the whole lot. Uh, and since I've been standing here, I've been here about 10 minutes and the engine has gone from a bare block with no, no rods in it, no rotating assembly, and it's, it's all together. And the head's on, the head's on one side and they're talking the heads up at the moment. But uh, 
that the driver's getting stuck into. He's packing the parachute as well. But uh, it's, it's like watching all of the guys working together. It's like watching, it's like clockwork. It's like all these people have got their own in particular, all those specific jobs. And it's, it's quite fascinating to watch. They're going to fire it up in about 10 minutes once it's all together. When I'm building an engine, it takes me weeks to do, but these guys have done it in like 10 minutes, 15 minutes. So they've test, they've run the engine, they tested it. It all went like clockwork, and uh, and now it's back together, and they're going to line up. Um, took four guys to put the body back on it, which was quite impressive to watch. But uh, yeah, now they're ready to uh, ready to rock and roll. our day at Las Vegas uh, Motorsports Park and it was it blew me away and it was a good take it was a lovely uh, experience to get in the pits and follow a pro team getting them put the car together and uh, and just seeing up from our perspective it was just amazing it's been a, it's been a real wild first day uh, the shooting was obviously awesome as well but uh, it, it, it touched me a lot knowing that uh, a lot of this stuff I would have experienced with my dad so dad this is for you uh, and this trip was, uh, I wanted to include this and see some drag racing and it's been an emotional day as well. So the dad and the family, that's for you. And for you guys at home, I hope you've enjoyed what you've seen. It's, uh, it's a bit of a vlog type video. It's not our normal review type stuff, but uh, it's too good to pass up and it's too good to miss. The show hasn't started yet. SEMA starts in two days. This was the first day. Tomorrow we got a warm up and then we're into the show. So I'll keep you posted.